Hey, what's up everybody? How's it going? Today we're going to be doing a showcase on Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta, the man. So, you know, we got him rainbow. He's max links, of course. We're taking him on Majin Vegeta's 200% leader skill. So the 8th year anniversary is only four days away on the Japanese version. And we already know uh, who the two new cards are going to be. So we're pretty much all under the assumption that this guy is most likely going to EZA during the 8th year anniversary, which I'm really hoping that's the case. I, I really do like this card. Um, ever since he came out, like, I, he's, he's just a really cool unit. Like, not as fen defensive as I'd like, um, but hopefully once he gets his EZA, he'll be, like, super solid. Especially to run next to the new Super Saiyan 3 and Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta. Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Because that's, uh, that's going to be one of the Dokkan Fest LRs. Literally this right here, just a different version, I guess. Because um, this is just Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta Angel. But um, one of the 8th year anniversary LRs is going to be Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta. So it'll be really cool. Super excited to see what those guys are all about. But yeah, so this is the team we're going to be rocking them on. Um, I think we're just going to hop into the Legendary Goku event. The OG Legendary Goku event. It's been a while since we hopped into here. And it looks like this is the last team I took. Must have been showcasing uh, either Vegeta and Trunks or... It looks like we're, we mainly went for the Goku Black team here. So I probably showcased these guys or something. Last time we hopped into here. But yeah. Easy A for 8 year. This guy. He has to. And I was looking up some of this guy's uh, best linking partners. I imagine the new LR... Uh, the new 8th year anniversary LR is going to be his best linking partner. They they might even share, like, every single link, other than Royal Lineage and Prodigies. Yeah, I wonder what they're going to do, because it's a Super Saiyan 3 Goku and a Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, I'm pretty sure. Um, I mean, because I, I don't know, I think their details were just released, but I didn't have a chance to look at them yet. So I don't know if they're an exchange unit or if they're actually just a joined forces team. But wow, look at all the categories now this guy's on. Um, but yeah, his two best linking partners are actually this guy and t the Tech Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. This guy and the Tech Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta share 6 out of 7 with this guy, so that's pretty cool. And there's a couple other units that'll share like 5 out of 7 or 4 out of 7. As long as you get those main four uh, links. He actually doesn't have prepared for battle, though, which kind of sucks. But he does have Royal Lineage and Golden Warrior, but those are his only key links. He does work pretty well with STR Vegito, too, because, um, you know, he's got the Goku in the card, so that can activate his active skill, plus his unit super attack here. So, yeah, let's... Uh, Let's hop in and see how our boy's been doing after all this time. All right, let's do this. And we actually didn't bring a Trunks with us, so we're not going to have Majin Vegeta's intro animation. And he's in slot 7, perfect for the showcase on him. But this this will give us time to get our rotations down. So right off the bat, um... I guess we'll float off the Goku for now. We'll, we'll get him back on on rotation, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna have him on a nice rotation once he gets on this turn with that Super Saiyan three Vegeta and then this Vegeta family support Zeno Vegeta. I don't think I've ever used this Super Saiyan three Vegeta. Like he got his Dokkan Awakening and I never used him. I didn't even have him Rainbow. Use SA3 from how many times I've pulled him. Um, so yeah, just for this video, I just rainbowed him. Just finished his super attack with some extra Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta's I had. And, um, you know, just rainbowed him. And we got Int Majin Vegeta. And this, honestly, this guy and the Int Angel Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, they could easy A too, man. That's what I'm really hoping for. Um, but if they're doing all these, and STR Super Brew, dude, please, STR Super Brew as well. 
Um, but if they're doing all these Majin Buu Saga easy A's, they're definitely going to have to do some for GT as well. So hopefully that is the case. Just let them pour out all the Extreme Z Awakenings, man. Best thing that's ever happened to Dokkan right there. Making these old units usable again. And honestly, I, I know I mentioned this in one of my other videos, like, they could they could start over with, like, the AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku. Like, I, I'm pretty sure he was the first ever Easy A. Like, they could just start over and just, like, revamp his Easy A or something and just make him, like, absolutely busted again. Like, you know, fitting in with t today's uh, meta of units. That would be cool. Um, so, alright. Here he is. We got 6 out of 7, all we're missing is Legendary Power. Yeah, I can't believe he actually shares this many links with this guy. Because he just has Limit Breaking Form. He has Legendary Power, but yeah, this is every link active. We got the 40% support. He's giving, yeah, Key 2 and 40% attack and defense, so. Just got his 18 key there. Sitting at 141k defense. Um, I, I guess we can go over his details and stuff at the end of the video. But yeah, let's see what this guy's doing. Let's see what he's hitting. 7.1. That's not bad at all. Didn't even get his unit super attack, because we don't have a Majin Buu Saga Goku on rotation. There's the additional 4.8. Nice. I like that final burst cannon, man. That animation looks sick. Honestly, just Vegeta doing all those key blasts. That's Vegeta's technique right man, right there, man. That's you just shooting all the key blasts. Yeah, I guess we can give Int Majin Vegeta the whole six. And not able to get six with the Tech Majin Vegeta, but that's alright. These guys actually share seven out of seven. Um, and this Goku, he, you know, he'll, he'll give key three in defense 30% to everybody, but only the Super Saiyan 2 category allies will get the extra attack 30%. That Goku's pretty good. He's probably the best easy A out of those three Super Saiyan 2, um, you know, hero extermination plan easy A's. I like using this physical one a lot, especially on a team like this. Don't have him link level 10, though. The only people who aren't link level 10 on the team... Um, is him, and then that Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta that we, we brought with us. I haven't even, I haven't touched his links, like I said. I just wrangled him for this video, so. The only reason I got, like, the Fizz Super Saiyan 2 uh, Goku there kind of link level was because I was using him during the, you know, Hero Extermination Plan Easy A event, Easy A area. Hmm, now right, let's put it... I don't know, this probably won't drop enough orbs for us to get his 18 key. Yeah, it looks like we're just one shy. I got a 17 key though. But yeah, not too bad. I'm excited, man. I'm just just about have a thousand stones on JP, which is like the most I've ever had. But I don't play the Japanese version, obviously, as much as Global, because Global is my main version, of course. Um, yeah, I can't believe I got like a thousand stones on there. I've been saving for a bit because I skipped the steps, up, step ups. I skipped uh, Gohan and Piccolo. Um, I've just been clearing like all the content I can with uh, my teams and stuff. Like all like old Super Battle Road stages I never cleared, or Extreme Super Battle Road, Fan Dragon Ball History, whatever it might be. Um, even some Red Zone stages I've been clearing over there on JP. So we can do some summons for the 8th year anniversary units, man. We're going to be playing JP for a little bit. Doing some JP Dokkan videos here soon, for sure. And yeah, we're almost to 500 subs, guys. That's, that's like, crazy to me, honestly. Like, I started YouTube, like, back in March. Like, the end of March. And I've just been doing, you know, mostly my dokkan videos and stuff like that but you guys have really been you know showing me some love and support and i really appreciate you guys for that so once once we hit the 500 uh sub mark i'm gonna have to do like a special video or something either just like taking a look at my account because my power level like just hit 2 million so that's pretty cool milestone um 
you know, just link leveling all these units and stuff. Hey, this, this time around, we'll be able to get his unit super attack and his active skill. I might, I might hold off on that until next time we get this guy around, I think. Maybe once we get against in UI Goku, we'll pop that. Um, but this is going to be a good rotation as well. Still got his 6 out of 7 links active, but he's going to get the unit super attack. So he's going to be hitting, I think, a little harder. Yeah, he greatly raises attack on this. He doesn't do anything. He doesn't do anything on his 18 key. He just greatly lowers defense. He raises defense on his 12 key, at least. Yeah, he needs an easy A, man. He's, he, he's going to easy A during the 8 year. I don't care what anybody says. He has to. It's like the perfect counterpart unit. I mean, they might might not share. I mean, they'll, the new Goku and Vegeta has to have, like, Saiyan Warrior Race, Super Saiyan, Fierce Battle, Legendary Power, at least. And probably Golden Warrior as well. Um, but yeah, almost 500, say, almost 500 subs, boys. I'm super pumped. I'm, I was honestly thinking about doing a cooking video for it. It's gonna make my world famous chicken Alfredo. <laughs> I don't know. I've never done a cooking video. It might be a little hard, but I could I could probably do it. Yeah, chicken Alfredo, man. I'll show you guys the way. We'll go pick up some broccoli just for it. I still got the chicken tenders sitting in my freezer. We just gotta thaw them out. <laughs> We can take the time to do that one day. Plus, it's been a little bit since I've made chicken alfredo, so it would be cool to do a cooking video on it. And then we'll be on our road to a thousand subscribers, man. So that'll be uh, super exciting. Look at all these int orbs, holy man. I'm definitely getting these these Majin Vegeta's full pass of this rotation. Other than the intro animation, since we didn't bring the trunks with us, so he's just missing out on that. What is it, 30% damage reduction with trunks? Or is it 20? One or the other. So this is going to be another, another good rotation for him, I think. Um, I don't think those tech orbs are going to fall the way I want them to if I take that, so I'm going to do this. Yeah, that's better. Almost got him a 24 key there. Still, yeah, he's going to be sitting at 141 probably pretty much this whole video. <laughs> Especially with this 40% uh, support on rotation. Um, but yeah, without his intro, yeah, he gets he gets the 30% if we have Trunks with us, and then he gets the extra 20% if he gets 6 orbs, and I'll have that 50% damage reduction. He's at, he's at 253, but this guy's actually pretty good. Like, I read his passive when I was rainbowing, and I'm like, okay, so he, he has a medium chance of guarding his HP 60% or less, but he straight up just has a high chance of guarding, which isn't the best. Um, there's still a high chance to guard, and if he does, he gets the dam- he reduces damage received by 40% when guard is active, so. If you get that guard to pop, pop off, man, that, that Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, he's- he's not taking damage, I- I- doubtful. Let's see if he's guarding right here. Okay, he took double digits. Time to get serious! We got the Dokkan attack for him as well. Gonna go Three point five mil. Yes, I, I might have to link level ten this guy. This that Super Saiyan three Vegeta seems pretty good to me. With his Dokkan awakening, <laughs> his Gallic shooting looks kind of cool too, I guess. Ooh, putting up the eight mil, Vegeta, <laughs> calm down, man. The big bang attack. That's such a weird big bang attack that Vegeta does. It's not like just a giant sphere of ki like that one. Like that one right there. It's just a straight like beam from his hand. Alright, we'll get we'll get uh, this Super Saiyan 2 Goku back over there so we can get the unit super attack, pop the active skill and all that. We might end up we'll probably end up doing it on um STR Goku. STR UI, we'll see though. Is he STR in Omen? I 
think he is. I guess we're about to find out. Yeah, he is. All right. We'll put him back out there. Guess we'll just give him those. Yep, that'll be fun. Hopefully the free-to-play units this year for the 8th anniversary are super solid as well. I don't know why they did that for the 7 year, man. Like, I don't know. <laughs> like, the free-to-play units for the 7 year were, like, worse than the free-to-play units from the 6 year anniversary. Like, we got LR Roshi, and then that Tech Tienen, or, yeah, Tech Tienen Roshi. And they were, like, so busted. They're so good. And then the seven year comes along and they're free to play units. We get we get that tech Gohan, Goten and Trunks, which I've I still like have never used rarely, barely, like at all. And uh what, the Goku and Chi Chi and the Bulma and Vegeta, like no dude, they're they're fodder. Like they're not good at all. Hey, we got the uh the ye old final explosion, might as well pump it. I know how to be rid of you now. For good. I'll keep you from coming back this time. I blow you to dust. Farewell, Bulma Trunks. Even you. <laughs> Badass man. Heck yeah. Such a cool active skill. Lost a little bit of HP there, though. Now yeah, we should be good. Whoa, STRUI. Dodging us like that, man. 7 mil from the friend Majin Vegeta. I was hoping to finish him off. Oh, we did. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Because this next rotation, we're going to have that Super Saiyan 2 Goku. We're going to be able to get the unit Super Attack and his active skill. Oh boy. This is going to be an intense rotation right here. Do we have any items with us? I, th I think it... Because I was, uh... I was attempting Cell Max runs, so... Yeah, we do have a Sensu. We'll take a Sensu, just in case. I mean, but all these guys are physical, so... I don't think we're taking damage. Yeah, he's sitting at 244. He's at 135. We've got the 30% attack and defense support. We've got his active skill. Yes, sir. This is going to be one, one devastating attack stat right here. Six out of seven links active. So he's going to get key one attack and attack 59% defense, 78% for one turn. And you can do that like right away. Like, yeah, starting from the third turn, if you have a Goku from the Majin Buu Saga on your rotation, you can do it on turn three, which is pretty cool. <laughs> you missed all the moose, oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't want the moose, man. Get out of here. I knew I should have turned this on <laughs> before I started recording. All right. Yeah, man, they're the perfect unit. Like, that active skill, I, I still love that active skill and OST. It's so good, man. He has to easy A during the eight year. He will. I'm telling you guys, he he absolutely has to. If he doesn't, I would, I would shit my pants. Like, there's no way they miss that opportunity. UI, you better not dodge our boy Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta, man, because he's about to put up like a 10 mil. 13.4, my bad. 13.4. <laughs> yes, give him an easy A. He needs it, man. He might be able to do those numbers still now to this day. Almost just one shot in UI. <laughs> but he's not defensive as we need him to be. He needs a buff. So we can actually run this guy in like the red zone and shit like that. 
Oh, dude. Yeah, we're not. It's not gonna kill him, but we'll pop it. I know how to be rid of you now. For good. I'll keep you from coming back this time. By blowing you to dust. Farewell, Bulma Trunks. Even you. Alright, nice little crit. Not our HP. And we should, yep, we got the seven orbs. We only need six to get his guard, so he should be good. Yep, I think this is gonna be it here. But yeah, like I was saying, guys, thank you for all the support and everything you guys are giving on the channel. You know, I really appreciate, you know, everything you guys do for me. And the feedback as well, I like to hear you guys' opinions on stuff, and what you're excited for, your pulls, your summons, you know, feel free to tell me whatever, and, you know, I, I always reply to you guys, and, you know, like your comments and stuff like that. But alright, that was, uh, that was a nice look at, uh, Super Saiyan 2 Angel Vegeta before he inevitably gets his easy A. I'm telling you guys, he has to. They would really miss out on a golden opportunity to easy A this guy if they didn't. Um, yeah, we can take a look at the team real quick. I can go over his leader skills, passive and stuff like that. All the categories he's on. He's on so many categories. My Int Majin Vegeta is 55%. Didn't, wasn't able to pull an extra copy of him on the step up banners course we got this man rainbow i think do i have extra copies of him no i don't surprisingly it, it's only a matter of time we'll, we'll pull extra copies of them don't you guys worry <laughs> it's gonna happen we got this guy rainbow i just rainbowed him yeah i gave him 28 or tw is that a six yep 26 six dodge because he does have crit in his passive plus i want him building up that defense from his super attack Tech Vegeta, I'm hoping this guy and the Int Dokkan Fest, um, Angel, Super Saiyan 2, Goku, Easy A as well, that'd be really cool. I think they would be really cool units, because I like their passive, you know, they get the boost, depending on how their HP is. Kind of like LR Bojack as well. You got this guy. Good little support <laughs> with his Easy A. He's, he's good to rock with this guy, I think. And then this, uh, Xenu Vegeta. And yeah, all right, this was a, a promise made to Kakarot, Super Saiyan 2, Vegeta Angel. So he leads Worthy Rivals category, Key 4, HP Attack and Defense 150, Super Fizz type, Key 4, HP Attack and Defense 100. He raises defense for one turn, causes Colossal on his 12 key, 18 key, just Mega Colossal and greatly lowers defense, man. He needs something on that Ultra. And then for his unit super attack, he greatly raises attack for one turn, causes Mega Colossal, and massively lower defense. What if they, what if he raised attack and defense, what if he stacked attack and defense on his 12 key, greatly stacked attack and defense on his 18 key, and then he just straight up massively raised his attack and defense for one turn on his unit super attack, that would be crazy, man. And then just kind of make his passive a little different. So right now he has attack and defense 70%, plus an additional attack and defense 4% each time key rises by 1 up to 70%. And then he gets key 3. When the name of the ally is attacking in the same turn, or enemy includes Goku, not Goku Youth or Captain Ginyu, or Goku Jr., etc. excluded. <laughs> plus an additional key 3. When there's a Majin Buu Saga category ally, whose name includes Goku attacking in the same turn. And he has this nice little active skill. Can be activated when there's a Majin Buu Saga category ally, whose name includes Goku attacking in the same turn, starting from the third turn from the start of battle. Once only. Key 1, attack 59%, defense 78% for one turn. Not bad. 
Might have to change up his equips if he does end up getting his easy A. I mean, it's, I don't mind that. 18, 14, 3. It's a nice little balanced build, I think. Um, his links are Su Saiyan Warrior Race, Super Saiyan, Golden Warrior, Legendary Power, Prodigies, Royal Lineage, and Fierce Battle. He's on Worthy Rivals, Resurrected Warriors, Majin Buu Saga, Pure Saiyans, Jesus Family, Otherworld Warriors, Super Saiyan 2, All Out Struggle, Connected Hope, Gifted Warriors, Time Limit, Mastered Evolution, Battle of Fate, Power Beyond Super Saiyan, and Bond of Parent and Child. Yeah, he's, he's, he's just on a couple categories. My man here. Yeah, so alright. Let me know how you, how you guys are um, doing in Dokkan and... If you're ready for the 8th year anniversary, I know it's just coming to JP and we still got months to wait on Global, but I'm still excited to see all the new units and you know, do some summons, and we'll, we'll definitely be doing some videos over there on that version for sure. Um, but alright guys, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.